Welcome back everybody, I am basically jumping back in straight away because I want to explore this dungeon. Um, so, welcome back to Archmage Rises, this is Avelina's story. Uh, in the last one we followed some goblins. Well, we accepted a quest from a shopkeeper to buy some of their equipment and then track down the goblin and kill it. But couldn't afford any equipment so we've gone searching for goblins anyway well walking around talking to people then we went off hunting for wolves with someone else because they're, sh they're not receiving shipments but we come across some goblins so I was like well try and take them down we'll see what we got um, so now we are here we're after some goblins we need to kill one really that's about it and then leave. I don't want to linger too long and suffer the dire consequences. Uh, I am going to check what spells I have. So we've got Arcane Insight, Fireball, Force Push, Air Pocket, Lightning Bolt, Wall of Stone, Earthquake, Acid Bolt, and Ice Shield. Which is a tasty spell. Um, click on the door to navigate through the dungeon. We'll use the arrow key. Enter a room can be dangerous. You can encounter a patrol of monsters. Well, the card behind you says ambush. So I feel like I may have been ambushed. <laughs> um, if the wall behind you has a door on it, yep. Uh, goblins were waiting for you. You have no light and cannot see much in the. Oh, cast a light spell, light a torch. I should have lit a torch. That was a lucky mistake. Combat! The goal of combat is survive. It's a permadeath game. If you die, you must start over. You are weak, but your spells are strong. Use your shield spell to protect you from damage. Uh, if enemies hit you, you may break bones or lose the use of limbs. Action points, as we know, are uh, basically mana. Cast a spell, click on it. Um, you slide to determine the amount of effort put into the spell, um, and then click on the location on the combat grid to cast the spell. Armor, two forms: physical, magical, simple. Weapon. If you have a weapon, you can use it. If not, you can punch things. Uh, other actions: pass and run. Last time, I forgot run was an option. That's ugly spider. Very, very nasty spider. I don't like you. You are a scavenger. Hello. And you are a malicious scavenger. You are a sharp eared scavenger. Deadly blood stalker. Not a fan of the name, if I'm honest. Uh, I'm definitely going to. I mean, technically, air pocket is probably the only. Um, I do have Ice Shield actually. So I'm going to cast Ice Shield on myself. Gain 37 to 51 physical shield. Yes, please. I'm also going to look at immune to multiple debuffs and incoming damage reduced by 18 to 23 percent for a turn. Uh, um. Does create acid pools and we cause damage. Eight, uh, 11 to 28 physical damage. Physical damage is their weakest point and your strongest. Um, we're going to deal with a sharp here. So here's one first. 11 acid damage. Then acid. Is going to hurt them hopefully each turn. Then we're going to cast lightning bolt. No. Let's 
sign the type with the focus. Hopefully we don't die. <laughs> Conceal. Interesting. Okay. I'm very glad we uh Use that shield. We got 12 out of 12 R. Uh, definitely going to cast our shield again on myself. Um, I'm going to cast Acid Block. And then I'm going to cast Force Push and push it away. And, uh, and that'll be my turn. Uh, if they just attack them, they've attacked me for physical damage with a throw. No fair. I guess then they missed. That's rude. That, that deadly blood. Stalker can't hit me from afar, so I'm going to push it back again. Because I'm not playing that game with that. Um, you know what we're going to do? We're going to cast that for baby. We play a game of keep that away from me and just keep it in every single acid because it seems to be working. Um, but two more. I'm going to pass my turn and save the two. It's going to take a move, it's going to conceal. What are you going to do? Here I come, you're going to throw. Five physical damage. You're going to conceal and then probably throw as well. Yep. But four physical damage. Then, they're both going to suffer some acid damage. I'm going to cast ice shield on myself again. The temptation to be cast is definitely there. Um, let's just see what that'll do. They're both down. I wonder what your um, yeah minus ten dodge increases enemy law level up to low. Nice. And then I'm going to might as well focus and get the extra aura. Bro, yep. Who would have guessed? New round. My turn. Can I smack you with a spear? Yes, I can. How much damage does the spear do? 27. That's tasteful. Yep, this one has got teeth. There you go. We've got different kinds of magic and a purse containing 38 gold. Uh, you have no light, you can't see. Cast a light spell or a torch. Uh, I did pick up some torches. I may as well use one. That's creepy. Uh, so, we're quite okay. Let's have we explore a little bit more. See if we can find anything before we skedaddle. That's a coloured blocked door. Uh, so I need a green key for it. Five separate locks. You definitely have quite a few things on the go. Ah, 
ambush again. Goblins leap to attack. You've got a Vexa and you've got a scavenger. I am going to throw up the Osho. I'm just going to stab the Vexa. So I don't want to mess with that. I'm going to stab you again. And I miss. Not good. Conceal and then throw. Think cloud. That's a plus twenty percent miscast. But you might run away. You know, might miscast. You can't miscast with a spear unless you continue to miss. And there we go. Um, plus sixty-six to dodge. You know what? to miscast. It's gonna be going anyway. Uh, fire attack for one. Fire damage. You can keep going. Health represent life. If it reaches zero, you die. What happened? Why did I suffer damage? Uh, I miscast fireball. And I'm assuming because I miscast fireball, it bounced back onto me. Uh, let's just continue to stab him. Up. Plus 20% of fire, X2, and more gold. Highlight you can get any interactable objects or highlights and cover them. Me means there's something in here I could probably interact with, like so. Found some trial rations, very nice. Um, I've suffered damage and hit point problems. Um, do I have anything that will heal hit points? No. Can use camp. I don't know if that's going to heal me. But we're doing quite all right with these goblins at the moment. Inside discovered. That means that's probably going to cause problems if I remember correctly with red. Um, and we got more places to disappear to. So what we're going to do? We're going to leave. I'm not going to mess with this one this time. We are suffering a bit of a beating. I don't want to see if we can finish off her quest anyway, so that is there. We know that, at least. Um, she was in Matwa? Did it tell me? Crossbox. Okay. She was the armorer, I do believe. Um, I was hoping you'd stop by. There's a cap I made today, though, which I'm quite proud of. I did what you asked. One thousand gold point, uh, gold pieces. I don't know why I said points. Uh, thank Ed Edarin. I've been praying for your safe return. The minute you walked out the door, tried to start to pick up, and I've been. It's been a night and day difference since then. Give your goal a little more size, I can't thank you enough. Um, services do you offer? Yet you're still quite expensive for what you are. So, let's attempt a fire. Uh, that's a fail. Worth a shot. 
did I go in? Oh, I don't know why I pressed that. Uh, let us go to the Conclave chapter. Um, services do you offer? Study in the Conclave library, experiment, or magic experiment, missions, in pursuit of learning requires 80 stamina. You have 82 stamina. Um, study a book, failures in magic missile. Days complete 10.1 uh, units per day 10. Uh, I'm going to hold off on that and just check if I have any quests. I do, but there's no limit. So that's a nice. Let's use a study a day away. 10 days go by. Uh, I've learned magic missile, gained free scholarship. Uh, ate food whilst I was here, got, got hungry, I gained arcane inspiration, don't know what that does. Uh, auto eating, when you become hungry you automatically eat some of your food from your inventory. Trail rations are prioritised but you have none. The food that will expire soonest and is overall best will be picked. Note that expired food whilst it can be eaten will not be auto eaten. Trail rations are a good cheap solution for travelling long distances that's a typo insight discovered scholar skill improved to three looks like we need to close it up okay thank you for your time so, and we will leave uh welcome back how you doing Services do you offer? Do you offer food? Because I'm hungry. Do you have any work for me? Uh, five dollars of honey. Being yeah, desperate of ending innkeeper in the next town over with push me to the brink. Uh, sorry, I don't think I can help. You must be in league. You look like one of them. Let me know if you come around. You really must be in league with them. You've known me the longest, you ass. Um. Look, I'm, I'm just gonna sleep in the stables. I'll have a look around, see if we'll find some honey. Enough mean, promises, but no well being, unhappy, minus 10, 10 stamina. Um, do you just uh, sort of didn't realize that I gave him minus to the well being as well? That's what I've had the cooked grains. Oh, I should have read more. Um, let's just need to drink. Okay, every time I buy something it gives me plus one. Uh, nausea, miscast, accuracy for an hour. Drunk! Can be removed by sleep. And then arcane inspiration lasts for a week. Gives me 100% to arcane skill XP. Very nice! Um, I'm going to... Um, I'm going to hire a single room, please. Because I need to sleep, and I don't want to lose well being for it. Should have rest, because I just realised that's a plus minus to well being, which means it's a negative to my well being as well. Which explains why my guy, why, why Avelina is in a bit of a poor mood. You're an angel. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm gonna compliment you before I leave. <laughs> what I could really do is like some form of companion who can just stand there and take the hits. Like a good mage, I will be able to sit at the back and stay out of the way. 
I studied that fully. Um, I have logged by one person. Just approved by one person. Which are the two people from. Two out of the three people from my backstory Sabina, Morga, and Joan. What does this do? That takes me to the core, that takes me to quests. That takes me to my spells, that's probably going to take me to relationships. Um, waiting and then settings. Settings. <laughs> I'm learning, guys. I'm learning. We're getting there. Um, so we should keep an eye out for honey, I suppose. Come across an unusually nice flower bed. The shrubbery almost looks maintained. You have no time to stop and smell flowers. Hide and see if anyone shows up or investigate the area. Um, so we investigate the area because that's odd. Start to look around. There appears to be a few ways you could go about doing so. Look around or cast arcane inside, which obviously. Mage baby. Cast arcane inside to determine that no magic is present. These flowers appear to be just that. Though you're unsure if they're maintained or not. Several thoughts cross your mind as to what you might do with the shrubbery. Decide what to do with the shrubbery. You contemplate the options for a moment. What sounds like the most enjoyable course of action. Stomp all over them. Calls about and help them grow. Play around in them. Spend time smelling them or burn them. I say call to and help them grow. Evelina is not the not a harsh person and obviously specializes a bit in earth magic, so I can imagine them being a bit of a land lover. Sounds a bit piratey, but yes. You shower the plants in rain, allowing leaves and flowers to drink up all the water. Gardening like this provides a calmness, a damp patter of the rain around you as you perceive a greater depth. The smell of honeysuckle and fresh dew. The sounds of wind and bees. A serenity is found here. Okay. But that is all. I kind of want to go and check this place out as well. But it doesn't seem to be anything worth checking there. What's really weird is that all these places are connected, but then... It's like completely surrounded by like a lot of mountains and all that good stuff. North Pass. Enter the town. Um, enter the town and there's no point because everywhere is closed. Let's go to the inn. How you doing, Juliana? Alice just placing the cake, she finishes it up. What can I do for you today? You can... Oh, better at the thing. Red Louse, I'm not sure I believe that. Can we talk again tomorrow? I've got things to do. Juliana, you are... What? There's someone complaining about how stew is getting bland. I'm going to need five bunches of toast to put it right. I've had that stew for 60 years. I'm not about to give up on it now. 60 years, what are you talking about? 
It started by my grandfather when he brought us in as a young man. Legend has it that Titani himself blessed this Jew while passing through the village before he became Prime Major. Mind you. And my family has kept going ever since. We had a little broth, a little ale, a little meat every day to take care of the stew and the stew take care of us. It's made our in famous around these parts anyway. But you're right, for the last year the stew is but they're right. For the last year the stew has been getting steadily duller. Maybe the blessings worn off, I don't know. Maybe it's time for drastic measures. Um I'll say save your stew. Remember five bunches of herbs, I reckon we have about a month before the stew loses five or whatever, so I need it as soon as you can. If the stew dies, the inn dies with it. No pressure. <laughs> so do they have they don't even have a stew for the food option. It's always good. Uh not want to close the red one. Have a rest in the sweet. Mm. Maybe not for that price. Um, have a single room. Nice well being, bit more hit points. Bada bing, bada boom, baby. Uh, compliment Juliana, and then we'll leave. We won't spend too long here because we want to find herbs. Um, Joan, do you run the market in North Pass, do you? Are you just going good enough yourself? We talk again tomorrow, I've got things to do, I'm going to compliment you, and I'm going to force you to talk to me, so you feel a bit better about me. Um, do you have herbs? No, you don't. Of course you don't. That would make my life easier. Leave and we will hunt down some herbs. That's cool. I don't know if it has any impact, but that's cool. We're going to explore. We are going to get 13. Success. Uh, we have found stone. I'm not too fussed about stone. I need herbs. Um, maybe Grossmoth has some. I'm going to tell you until we get there, though. Enter the town, pay the five gold. The docks are closed. Oh dear. Market. Services do you offer? Or do you offer herbs? The answer is no. Is there any jobs anywhere else? Graveyard has a job. No, it doesn't. The armorer does not either. Where's your day going? Uh, Conclave maybe? You do have work for me. For you? You're not even a ma real mage yet. Fine, go kill some goblins. There's several bands outside the town that have been born in my side for months. While the council visiting... Uh, with the council visiting so soon, we're all far too busy to deal with them, so you might as well do it. I'll do it. I've dealt with some before. Uh, we think there's an ancient site out there, but our scholars can't get close enough to find out. Getting the goblins out of the way would help immeasurably. Leave the bodies once it's done, and I'll have Amicia Healer go inspect them. She does some field work with us from time to time. Thanks. Uh, Amicia. Amicia. Hello. Uh, don't you have something better to do? Not really. I'll be honest with you. Can't talk. Yep. Well, now you're indifferent to me, so what are you gonna do? So 
I'm going to use help with him tired of seeing fine young adventurers dragging, dragged into my shop at death's door. Their veins full of spider venom. Something must be done. You want me to kill them? I don't do spiders. Uh, you want me to kill them? You can do better than that. I'm a healer. Violence alone is not ever the answer. I want you to find the collie, kill a few, come back. Tell me where you left the body so that I can harvest the venom and develop a remedy for it. Can you do that? Sounds simple enough. I don't know exactly where the spiders are or how many of them there are. I think the weaponsmith, uh, Idonia, is what I'm gonna go with. Tangled with some recently, you'll have to ask her for more information. Don't let him laugh at you, though uh, she thinks what we do here is a waste of time. Okay, uh, well, we'll get to the end and we'll have a rest. Don't work for me. Honey, sorry. I'm wasting your time. I'm wasting everyone's time. And that is where I'm going to leave the episode. We're already at the half hour mark. I'm really enjoying myself, but I didn't even notice. Probably gonna jump into the next episode just to do more. Because, why not? Thank you all for joining me. I'll see you in the next one. I've been a little man gaming. Peace.